My neighbor was out of town, so she checked her security camera and saw that there was a dog sleeping on her porch. She got in contact with my other neighbor and they were trying to help catch the dog. But every time they tried to get a hold of him, he would run away from them. I was just on my normal walk with the dogs. I turned around and he was just there. Hey buddy. He just followed my dogs, Kokoro and Chibi, into my backyard. He was definitely nervous. Good boy. His tail was down, but I think he knew that we were trying to help him. Come in. He looked like he had never been inside before. His tail was down and he was looking around really sheepishly. Once we gave him a little bit of time to come in, he picked a place to settle down. You like that spot? He was really good. You want this? Good boy. Even after just staying with us that first night, he started looking a little bit more joyful already. Oh, look at your little tail. Good hey, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, good boy. Took him to the vet. Good boy. <laughs> they did the general physical. Good boy. He didn't have parasites or worms, but he was very underweight. Good boy. Good boy. Look at you all clean. When we gave him his bath, he just looked so sad. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. <laughs> he doesn't know how to leave shows. <laughs> Good boy. So you feel lock on it. I think he observed a lot and just picked up on how our dogs were acting and followed suit. Good boy. I was worried, but my dog seemed to immediately like him and welcome him into our home. <laughs> Kokoro has had a couple bad experiences with big dogs, so I was pretty shocked to see her running around with Mello. That was really amazing to see. After being with us for a couple days, I think he got a little more comfortable, and he did start wagging his tail. The happy boy. Happy boy. Look at your little sploot. Look at it. Look at that. It just felt good like we were doing the right thing. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh, good boy. <laughs> He had a little bit of separation anxiety. I just felt like he really deserved someone's full attention. I like to think that they could tell that it was Melo's last night because they, they definitely were acting different with him that night. It was the most that they had ever played. Thankfully, we were able to find him a home. <laughs> they chose the name Mellow because of his mellow and sweet personality. I think it was a perfect fit. The whole experience was pretty incredible. He was honestly one of the sweetest dogs I've ever met. <laughs>